checking out another one of these amazing overlooks here at uh, Colorado National Monument. One not a lot of folks have heard of. Maybe we should. It's quite the expansive view. Something keeps swooping us. Did you hear it go by? Mm -hmm. If I go stand on that rock, will you take no. my picture? But I'll stand on it. No. No. Just I'm gonna stand on it. Getting ready to leave the little overlook here we found. We found a cave. Check that out. Oh. With a lizard. Did I did. Did you get it? I did. He's right up here. Where'd he go? Where'd you go, little lizard? There he is. Whoa, he's fast. This is Larry. Larry's a lizard. He lives in Colorado National Monument. Hi, Larry. What would you like to tell the people about Colorado National Monument? Well, it's big, there's lots of rocks, and it's really hot in the summer. All right, I'm out of here. Well, that's not how we start. Star, get out of the hole! Oh, here comes the lizard. That is a long ways down. So Heaven's taken the more difficult route. Can she make it around the corner? She made it! What a move! <laughs> she took the shortcut. are the coke ovens. Early visitors thought they resembled the little ovens that people use, so they were nicknamed that. Very cool. Tons and tons of things to see around every corner is a new amazing overlook. Well, 
Colorado National Monument was pretty neat. Lots of views, nice road to drive that had just tons and tons of scenic views and vistas. Anybody have any thoughts on Colorado National Monument? I like the scenic drive. It's very scary but beautiful. Nobody else? There was a ton of lizards. Big lizards, little lizards, in between lizards, lizards everywhere. Alrighty, well, I guess that's going to wrap up our short day visit to Colorado National Monument. I uh, got a couple of new Colorado National Monument Junior Rangers in tow, and we are off to the next adventure. So until next time, take care.